Stop trying to find your manhood through your dick. I want you young black, I want you black men to imagine a world where I did this. Snap my fingers, Thanos, reality stone, and away goes your penis and your balls. Every last one of your black dicks goes away. Then what are you? Your testosterone levels stay, your muscular levels stay, everything else remains, but your dicks are all gone. Where are you? What kind of man are you? Far too many of us black men try to make our masculinity and manhood through our dicks. We spend an inordinate amount of time in our youth trying to fuck our way into manhood. That's why you got so many young guys who aren't even where they should be thinking, I can fuck my way in, I can make her this. You and you, and what do you rank amongst other men? We're the only group of men who walk around with our dick thinking that makes us a man. Go around other groups of men. They don't have to walk around and hire the CEO. Hello, or whatever the accent you want to put in. They are not judged by their penis, their ability to fuck. And we have bought into this shit. Stop it. Stop leading with your dick. Stop leading with your game. Stop leading with your mouthpiece. So I said, lead with your wallet, which is your resume. Who you are. I don't hear as many young Asian men, Middle Eastern men, trying to control, get women on the right page. I'm in, I'm in law school. I'm in grad school. I'm in this. I'm in that. I'm trying to buy this business. I'm investing in it. And we're trying to fuck our way through. No, no, this is why we, like I said, I'm going to stick it. We spend two, I don't, I, first time when I came to YouTube it was the first time I heard all this talk, inordinate amount of talk of game. And I did it too. I did it too. I'm not going to lie. I did it too. When I was young, I thought that made you a man. The more, the more cut you got, the more you made a man. And, there, and there's a point in time when you're like, this is stupid. Every time you lay down with somebody, you risk either getting a sexually transmitted disease or creating a life. It's reckless. It's meaningless. And there are numbers you get to where you can be ashamed of like, God, I've had all this sex for what? Fucking doesn't make you a man. Now fuck, but it doesn't make you a man. That's for that's for the family.